Listen to some of these statistics. 58% of women don't feel as if their physician takes their health concerns seriously all of the time. And 46% of women, Montel, have switched physicians because they feel they're just not heard. That's crazy. Plus, 75% of patients said that they would feel much more satisfied if their physicians performed lab tests and discussed the results while they were in the office. That's a good idea. I like that. Well, today we're on location in Minneapolis, Minnesota, to see how one physician is working to change these numbers one point of care test at a time. Today, OBGYN Dr. Juan Angelats is meeting with his patient, Ashley Marzilla. I have seen Dr. Angelats for the last 12 years and he has delivered all three of my children. Since I'm a mom of three, I um, understand how important it is to take care of yourself while being pregnant and prenatal care is a huge factor in that um, during pregnancy and at your delivery. During the course of her pregnancies, Dr. Angelette tested Ashley for gestational diabetes at about 28 weeks, an important part of the standard of care. Gestational diabetes is uh, when a woman does not control her glucose level properly. And if her glucose levels are very high, this can in turn affect the development and growth of the baby. Testing for anemia, typically defined as low hemoglobin and associated with iron deficiency in both pregnant and non-pregnant women is also crucial. Anemia is kind of a measure of a person's blood volume. If they have a low hemoglobin, then they can have symptoms of typically one is fatigue, decreased energy, sometimes somebody looks more pale. Um, but it's important for somebody's well-being because certainly we all want to feel as good as we can on a day in and day out basis. So if somebody's profoundly anemic, it can really affect them both physically and mentally. Diagnosing gestational diabetes and anemia in pregnancy is extremely important for our patients because having one or both of these conditions can potentially negatively impact the pregnancy and we would like to know about it, address it, help the patient as much as we can to have the uh, most healthy pregnancy and outcome as possible. That's why he makes sure whenever possible to use point of care diagnostics within his practice. Point of care testing does provide our patients with immediate results. They do not have to wait uh, for the results to return. Sometimes that can cause undue anxiety as they're awaiting a result, um, which could potentially impact them whether they're pregnant or not. And we can sit down with the patient, talk to them about the results, make a plan moving forward if deemed necessary, answer any questions that may come up, and just make sure that everybody's on the same page. Within our office, uh, we provide uh, point of care testing via the HemiQ device. It's a simple finger stick for the patient and uh, for either obtaining their glucose or hemoglobin, and the results are uh, returned within minutes. And that's significant because external labs typically take one to two days for results, whereas HemaQ's point of care testing gives immediate lab quality results for issues related to conditions such as anemia and diabetes. It's considered lab quality when compared to an outside laboratory and may save you from additional out-of-pocket expenses. Being a busy mom, coming into the office for one appointment, you know, less appointments is better and knowing that I get those results right away in office is beneficial because it helps with my anxiety, just knowing that I don't have to wait for those results in case something may not be right and I'm able to speak with the doctor right then and there and we can come up with a plan if so and it's also wonderful to know if things are good then you have that peace of mind. Remember to ask your doctor about point of care testing and always seek more immediate information about your health. The technology, by the way, is available and easy access. And of course, for more information, you can always visit hemaq.us or go to our website, thebalancingact.com. We'll be back right after this.